What's up traders? Greenwood Stocks coming at you. I uh, want to talk about patience in the market today. Uh, super slow market. Let's take a look at the overall market. And I mean, you're just seeing basically um, nothing today. So uh, you look at the NASDAQ and everything's pretty much pulling back to support. So on days like this, you got to be patient. You know, there's no reason to force anything. Uh, we took some trades. Uh, they they didn't quite work out yet, so we're still holding them. But uh, we pretty much sat on our hands the whole day and wanted to look at what was going on after hours. After hours did get pretty interesting. We took this trade ISIG. Now, remember the last video, we were talking about how you play after hours stocks. So what you want to do, if you, you want to make sure that you get a good catalyst first or something in a hot sector and make sure it's a quality catalyst make sure the news is something that's going to move the stock so what we did was we got an isig now the main reason we got an isig the volume picked up after hours and also we saw it ran to 245 so 245 and it's pulling back look at where support is look at where support is the the move started before at 67 and then you see a little support here right here in this area you see this around 85 and then you see some support around 90 so you know that it shouldn't go too far below that if it does uh, pull back some but either way we took this trade now what did we say the first pop and pullback you want to get in on okay look at this great entry when it pops okay it's going to pull back it's 89 cents what's 89 to 134 you're looking at almost a 50 percent gain or more than a 50 percent gain okay so we actually got in on the second pullback we saw it pop again to 103 it pulls back to 99 i said i'm in once again of course it runs so the 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 common pattern is a big pop a pullback and when it makes a new high you're almost guaranteed that this thing is going to keep running after hours we're looking for a gap up okay arpo let's look at what happened there arpo arpo so it popped after hours we got in on a pullback the reason why we got in the pullback is look you're not getting in on these pullbacks and you're chasing you're in at the very top and you're selling at the bottom now we did get in at 149 that's too high however uh this, this should run uh pre-market tomorrow if not we only got a really small position so uh it's not going to be a big loss or anything like that the news was that they announced the first patient of its phase two trial and keyword covid so we're looking at this to possibly get some momentum tomorrow and a big float uh and it having a small float the last stock that we want to see that we want to talk about is G O E D. So this this is why you have to exercise patience. You know you you're getting a you're you're in here and you're just you know you're sitting in your cash and then boom you get a 210 million dollar deal now or some reports said 300 million. Now we always look at the stock what the news is relative to what the stock is worth. Right now this stock. The market cap is 42 million dollars okay what what would 200 to 300 million dollars do to a 40 million dollar stock it's going to quadruple it at least or it should quadruple it so now you see 6 12 it doubles it we may get another nice uh run pre-market and if we do then getting in here now see there was no pullback there, there was no pullback on these first this first uh these first few five minute candlesticks so but like i said if you're getting in on this pullback right here always watch the 20. you're getting back on this pullback right here ten dollars to 14 that's not bad that's four eight that's you know 40 50 percent uh return on, on your money especially if it keeps running up okay so again practice patience you know nothing really ran today you, we didn't see we didn't see much today we got in ssnt ssnt again patience we got in it popped at 348 we got in on the pullback at 290 okay 
now it's at 346 so don't chase up here wait till they pull back to support and then you can pick a more favorable entry okay patience 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 especially on down markets the market will present you with an opportunity just be ready for it please like share subscribe as always we are available for coaching we are filling up our time slots so message me on twitter or shoot me an email if you want to do coaching and thank you for watching